Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today I just want to hop on here and like check in with you guys since we've been sick here for a few days. And I wanted to show you, I got a little finished object and I'm showing the yarn I found the other ball with the band on it. <laughs> so my finished object is, this is the ear warmer pattern that Pamela from Pamela's Adoring Crochet just put out uh, a week ago, I think. Is that Saturday? I think a week ago today. <laughs> so I finished my ear warmer. Here it is. And uh, I did follow her pattern, except I don't know how many rolls I did. She said to do 52, and I just did as many as I took to go around my head. <laughs> and then I did do the two rows of single crochet on either side for the border. So the yarn that I used is Manola Ombre uh, Mantra. So here's uh, the other ball I had that is a full ball and the ball band. So it's Manola Ombre. Oh, here's where it says Mantra. <laughs> so this is a number four worsted weight. And it is 100% acrylic, I'm for sure. Yeah, and it's 344 yards per skein. And I do have two skeins of it. This is the one that I made this out of. And I actually just barely started her scarf pattern. <laughs> I just literally started getting it started. And then we ended up having to get in the truck and go somewhere. So, uh, I gotta get that going. <laughs> but for both projects, this and the scarf, it's gonna be a H hook, which is a 5 millimeter. So, I got the ear warmer done. And I wanted to make the, I think it's called the bubble stitch scarf or something like that. I wanted to um, get that made. I like this a lot. This would even be a good cow for people like me who like the cows um, close to the neck. <laughs> but yeah, so that's what I worked on. I made this uh, two days ago. And then I tried to start the scarf yesterday and that's when we ended up going somewhere and I was busy a lot of the day. And then uh, another thing I wanted to show you is I got my letters from my sister for my Halloween countdown. I just, I gotta put them on there. So she made them for me. I think they're two inches tall. And uh, I think that's what she said. So like there's number one. She made them with the thicker felt. I don't know what it's called. It's not like regular felt, but it's like a pressed felt maybe. I don't know. But she got all the numbers here. And here's line number two. And so she's got them all stacked up there for me. So I got to hot glue them onto my calendar, which I might try to do today or... Um, uh, some this weekend and then she also made me the jack skillington eyes because i messed up the one <laughs> so she went ahead and made me two extra ones so that i could maybe get them on him without messing them up <laughs> and then also back um when i met connie from connie's crafty crap crafty corner i forgot what it is now i can't remember anything uh she gifted me the button maker or the badge maker and then uh i took it to my sisters we made some buttons ended up gifting her some of the buttons connie and then uh, i left it at my sister so she could help me make some more buttons badges whatever you call them uh because i want to include them on like giveaways and stuff in the future with bags so she made me four five <laughs> i can't count uh just with my logo on it so it's just uh is it blown out i can't tell I'm trying to mirror you on my TV. <laughs> so I'm trying to look on the TV to see if it's uh, focused or whatever. But it's just got my logo on it. And so it says no catching and crochet. And a pink color. And then the black is the words on that. So I did a badge. So I got five of them. So probably in the next few giveaways, I'll be throwing some of these in there um, for the people. And then eventually, uh, I bought a whole bunch of those. I think they're called SVGs or something like that. For Cricut, they're like files that you buy so you can use them. Um, for her to use in her Cricut of uh, yarn related things. So I thought we could make some uh, yarn sayings and stuff and then I could include them in giveaways and uh, all that jazz. So I got five of those. <laughs> I may keep one of those and then um, put that other four in giveaways. That's all the little stuff my sister cut out for me on her Cricut. <laughs> so I am hoping to work on my scarf today with this pretty yarn. I love Mandela Ombre. When Mandela first came out, I remember I really liked Mandela. But it was so thin because it was a size 3 of the regular mandala. I did make a baby blanket out of it. And I think I made a circular vest. Maybe a couple other things. But those are two things I remember. Um, but I really love the mandala ombre because I love the way it looks. It's uh, like marled or whatever. And uh, it's thicker. It's a number 4. And now mandala has all kinds of different tops. But uh, I really love the mandala ombre. I have these two. And then I have probably like 4 maybe more cakes of it in different colors. So, um. I really love working with it. <laughs> and uh, I got a purple one, I know. <laughs> I can't remember the other ones. But I just think it's such a pretty yarn. And I love working with it. It always works up really good. And I like it. 
but yeah, so I'm mostly better. I still have like a hoarseness to my voice. I don't, I don't know if you can hear it, <laughs> but I can hear it. June is mostly better. She's just a little bit coffee still. And Dev, or Jesse's pretty much all the way better. He, he gets kind of, like if he's playing really rough and running around playing, he gets uh, coffee. <laughs> I don't know how to say that. He, gets, he coughs a little. But we're almost all the way better, which is good. Because <laughs> I want to get all these germs gone, and then I want to finish those bags and get them in the shop so I can work on some Halloween bags. Because it's already almost October. So I need to get those going. But yeah, so I guess I'm just going to hop off here. I just wanted to do a quick little update and share with you guys my uh, ear warmer. <laughs> I keep wanting to call it a cow. And uh, the things my sister made. But I'm going to hop off here and get this edited. I'm using a new phone today. My brother gave me a phone. It's a new-to-me phone. It's one of his older phones, I think. And I think the camera is better than my old phone. So I'm trying to use it today to see. <laughs> so let me know if you think the quality looks better. I don't know. But I'm hoping it does because my other phone speakers were going out. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to hop off here. And I will see you guys in another video hopefully soon. And it's just like a week away from Vlogtober. I'm going to try my hardest to participate in Vlogtober. Uh, barring anything crazy happening like another sickness hitting the house or something. Or just crazy with the baby. But, oh, and speaking of baby, she's got two little teeth bumps on the bottom. So she's almost got her first two teeth. I'm super excited about it. But anyways, for real, I'm going to hop off now, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.